so here's here's the Wednesday quickie. We're gonna do some sweet potato fries, but I'm gonna use this crazy contraption. It's called um, la pre le presse. Bugs me because presse is a French word and it's feminine and it should be la. But anyways, I'm not gonna say anything else about that. I'm gonna take a picture of the whole thing. I can't fit it all in the lens, but it's a big friggin' thing. But what I like about it is uh, it has like. 10, not 10, probably eight different attachments. I'll take a picture of that too. So you can cut and slice and all that stuff. So, but the best part, I didn't buy this new. I got this at a yard sale for five bucks. It was new. She had never used it. So I was like, you know what? I'm going to try this out. Just see what it does. So I have my sweet potatoes all peeled and everything. I got five potatoes. So this is the first time trying this machine, so wish me luck. I don't know how this is going to work, but we'll see. It's got a handle for you to... Oh. It's because I'm short, you guys. Let me get my step stool. Okay, I had to get my step stool because that was not easy. It's not for short people. Let's just put it that way. All right, so the potato in there. There you go. Not that difficult. I mean, it's sweet potato is a lot harder than a regular potato, but look at that's going to make beautiful fries. Because when I did sweet potato fries in my active fry, because I have not tried it in my DeLonghi yet, I cut them by hand and they were really thick and stuff, and it took a while to get them crunchy. So I hope this works. I hope this makes them a little bit crunchy. So let me finish that and we'll get back to putting the season on it, okay? All right, there they are. It's going to be basic. I'm going to use Tsang stir fry oil. It's infused with garlic and herbs. It's so good, you guys. It's a very good uh, air fryer oil friendly. So, did I, what did I say? How did how did that come out? It's a very air fryer friendly oil. Whatever, okay. So probably a good tablespoon of that. Let's try to get them all coated. Boy, that oil smells good. Okay, so here I have a good teaspoon of kosher sea salt and a good teaspoon of uh, black pepper. Let's put a half of that. Gonna try to get all the fries, you know. So I'm hoping if they're cut thin like this or small fries that it'll get them crispy. We shall see. All right, let me reposition, reposition the air fryer here. That's okay. Ooh, that smells good. All right, so I've got the paddle in. Let's dump them all in there. Those are up, bottom, top, add a four. Let's do it. There they are. That was like a good 35 minutes. So we're going to plate it and we'll taste it. Okay, let's go. Mmm. Delicious. That came out a little crispier than when I sliced them really big. It's still a little soft inside, but way better. So again, 35, 40 minutes, it takes a while. And the ends get all dark and stuff, but that's good though. That's the crunchy part. But they're good. All right, thanks for shopping, bye.